Hello everyone, hello co-investors, good day, I hope everything is well with you. Today I'm gonna show a tutorial on how to invest directly to IPO stocks using the PSE or the Philippine Stocks Exchange platform. So this is a new platform and this has just been released last August or I think June 2019 as the new say, for example, Rappler, uh, this was just launched la launched last June 3 so it's just been around for uh, two months now so simply go to easy or e a s e e a s y dot p s e dot com dot p h so punta lang po kayo rito whenever you want to trade or you want to prepare yourself to buy an IPO and what is an IPO by the way of course it's initial public offering that means that a certain company is entering the Philippine Stocks Exchange or the stock market for public investments. They are now open for public trading, for public shares, or uh, trading for shares. So for, for, for the primary purpose of uh, raising capital. So ito po yung mga most, mostly mga new companies or startup companies or companies who have been long in existence pero uh, na nilang making public so the tendency always not not really all the time but once you have an IPO subscription and naka subscribe ka initially day or a day or days after after that uh, you can most likely share your shares sell your shares at way 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 higher price so I have a previous video where in uh, that's just this day August 20 2019 uh, uh, KPPI uh, stock has just increased up to 50%. So Cap Wealth, that's a new, the first IPO of two, 2019. No, so I'm gonna go to register now, and uh, uh, please bear in mind that you should have a trading account. What do you mean by trading account? That's a broker account, as I believe. That's the same with Call Financial or BPI uh, Investment. So let me see. Let me open for you. What are these? So just click yes so if you click no you are not allowed you so you must have so it says in order to create an investor account user should have a trading account if no trading account exists please visit all right so if you click th there you will see the list of all these uh, trading accounts so just simply click yes and you can select among all these brokers or trading account platforms for you to buy uh, to buy IPOs or stocks, no, and uh, well, primarily is uh, the disadvantage if you just use, for example, call financial alone or New World Securities or one of these, is that the IPO subscription or, or allocation per trading account is just fixed or limited, no. But if you go directly to easy.pse.com.ph, you will have a higher no uh, opportunity to subscribe to IPOs. So if uh, as of August 20, 2019, yung KPPI or Cap Wealth are, are originally traded na from those people who, who have uh, invested or subscribed at easy.psz.com.ph. So this is a very useful tool. It's a move of the government to open up the stock market to the LSI or Tayo. Ako is a, uh, I'm an example of LSI, just a very small local small investor. Uh, and also to achieve inclusivity no, sa ating bansa na yung investments hindi lang po nanggagalik sa mga foreign, sa mga big companies, sa mga billionaires. So kahit, kahit karaniwa at ordinaryong tao na mamayang katulad ko ay pwede na rin mag-invest. Pwede nating ilagay ang ating unused money na imbes na nasa alkansya lang o nasa savings account, why not put it into good use and to grow it? So just a reminder lang po, investments are not something that you need uh, in the next few days or few years. Hindi po yan yung pambili ng gatas, uh, pambili ng bigas, o pambili ng ulam at pambayad ng kuryente. Investments are as a money that you have set aside that you are allocating for future use and for growth. Now, of course, you have uh, you are to expose it in a risk, meaning there there would be times, there could be a time na surprise ka na bababa siya. Well, of course, that's the nature of investments. So you must be willing to let go 
of it mean uh, in the sense na uh, bababa siya at some points kung especially yung napili mong investment instrument ay uh, bumaba no at a certain point so i will now fill up so select an investor if you are an lsi a person no uh, i will now fill up my personal details i'm gonna pause my video to answer these uh, uh, data there's these uh, fixed data so i'm gonna fill out my variables uh, sa input uh, windows uh, i'm gonna get back to you okay so ito lang po for a glance so just prepare these also profile photo i'm gonna pause now all right so going back so before you gonna be approved for easy psc.com.ph you must uh, make sure you will upload your profile picture and also select your trading account and go to your email to confirm uh, the, uh, the confirmatory email sent by the Philippine Stocks Exchange. So right now I am inside the PSE Easy interface uh, investor account, small, uh, uh, a local small investor account. So we, we can see here the subscription details uh, maybe in the future you will see here the list of your subscriptions and the company and the list of statuses so you can uh, filter them since we still have no IPO so we cannot see anything active events I'm really not sure or don't know now what does this active events mean but for the upcoming IPOs I expect to see uh, Money Villars All Home and the other coconut um, the coconut related IPOs but uh, they're not so what's the other name for that the Axelum resources but I can't see it as of now so maybe they're still working out the papers the etc the approvals legwork so I'm also trying to filter the subscribe the in drafts and I can't see no Mm, we can also toggle the uh, my trading participant so the purpose why I uh, you have to select your trading uh, trading uh, company or the broker is that I think they will have the representative to do the part the uh, exchange for you such as like this I'll call financial for uh, other person but it's not all right so this is how the uh, IPO a UI inter or the UI user interface looks under or it's a good thing now that our government is investing on digitalization especially when it comes to fintech such as this for the betterment of inclusivity the, the progress of inclusivity in our country and for the glory of God of course to God with the glory this is Brian Villarosa once again Jesus Christ alone can save and satisfy our souls thank you uh, John 316, bye-bye.